Right here is where I decided for this video I should have a glass of wine, because if I'm blowing a party popper, I gotta make it look like a fun party, and the only way I ever have a fun party is when my inhibitions are lowered, therefore wine. This is the part when I realized that this would be harder than I thought, because if you're trying to spit something out of your mouth that has a hole in it, the air is going to go through the hole, and the thing you're trying to spit out will not go the distance. I don't know what that part was, because I'm off screen, but it sounded like I just wanted to blow it again, so cool. Here's the part where I wanted to get the one noise for the beginning of the video, and I knew it had to be loud and punctual, so here we go. Look at how proud he looks. <laughs> I have no idea if this is going to work. What he's talking about is my, at the time, genius idea to put scotch tape over the tiny hole of the party popper so that the wind would not go through it and therefore it would spit further. What do you call these? I was gonna say like, oh, noise popper, take test, take one, but like, are these called noise poppers? To this day, I still do not know. Test. As you can see, this is where I realized I had bit off more than I could chew, because sadly dropping it out of my mouth would not be as funny as actually projectile spitting it off the side of the screen. I'm hoping for volume. I want it to like go this way, like out of the top corner here. I don't know who he's talking to because I'm talking to you, but this is, he's just like this. <laughs> the sound is going to be rough on that. He's right about that. I had to turn down the sound in editing because, in actuality, it was a very gross, loud noise, and it would have ruined what I would hope to be a funny moment. At this point, I was starting to get a little worried, because every time I spat it, it was falling down limp and sad, which is not the vibe I want to put off. Actually, I didn't think this through. When I, when I spit, I'm going to be out of breath, so I can't roll into the next line. A normal person would decide the bit is not worth it, but I was determined to be a funny, funny YouTube man, and I wanted to spit it and say the line within the same breath. We did it, nerds. This is why you always memorize your line before you start rolling. I am a really bad actor. We did it, nerds. We survived another year. That's not what I'm saying. We survived to see another year come and go. The tests were not going great, and I was burning my camera battery. At some point, I just decided to wing it and see what I could get. We did it, nerds. We survived long enough to see another year come and go. It's a little cheesy. Not that I'm not cheesy. We'll do one more take. Sometimes when I'm filming, I do talk to my editing self because I know he's really going through it, having to edit a video for eight hours a day, so, um, uh. We did it, nerds. We survived long enough to see another year come and go. And that is the take I ended up using. Thank you for watching this video, and I hope you laughed when that joke played in the main video because, um, I was really looking for laughs.